Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, what happens if I fail a urinalysis or a UA or a drug test while I'm on probation? Let me ask you this, what do you think happens? Let me give you a pop quiz. A, you win a free trip to Disneyland. B, the judge and you have a good laugh and then you go out to lunch and the judge buys. Or C, you get thrown in a jail cell, your probation gets revoked, and you probably serve a prison sentence. If you chose anything but C, then you're wrong. Hello. When you're on probation, you're not on vacation. You don't get rewarded for failing a urinalysis while on probation. You get punished. This isn't rocket science. It's common sense. There may be leeway on your first drug test, but after that, you're likely facing jail or prison. Why? Because being on probation is an alternative to incarceration. It's a gift of sorts, but it's given to you by an Indian giver. And that person can take it back very easily and at any time. You should always keep that in mind while you're serving probation. It might help to think of your time on probation as walking on a tightrope. If you stray just a little to either side, if you lose your concentration or your balance, even for a moment, you fall. However, instead of landing on the ground, you're going to land in either jail or prison. There are not many constants in the law. But one of them is that neither prosecutors nor judges tend to look favorably upon people who squander the opportunity when they've been given a chance to serve a community-based sanction instead of being in custody by willfully and substantially violating the terms of their probation. And that definitely includes failing a drug test. I thank you for your question. I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, then please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll be putting out more soon.